The CEO of the NLA, Kofi Osei Ameyao, in an interview with City Business News, lamented the huge revenue losses which emanated from the regime where the activities of the private lotto operators were not properly regulated. Since June 2018, all persons interested in undertaking the private business are expected to pay license fees of 100,000 cities per operation in a region. This translates into 1 million cities when an operator wants to operate across the entire 10 regions at a time. Though there was some amnesty to allow the operator's time to comply, Mr. Ameyao maintains that the outfits will be clamping down on all non-compliant operators henceforth. He spoke at the launch of the NLA's new VAC Lotto to support veterans in Ghana. We are now issuing out the license. It is not only fees. I said there that you need to pass a certain criteria a time of application, a time of decision. If you don't pass that criteria and you've paid money, it doesn't give you a license. You must pass the, uh, go through the criteria. Then once you are issued with a license with terms and conditions, which means no more paper writing. It is all on the POS. It is real time. So when they buy the lottery, we can see everywhere, including themselves that this amount of lottery has been bought. So if it's 500 million cities, then the government knows we made 500 million. This person is taking this share. You have taken your share. Government is also gotten their share. The winners have also been paid. And we are all happy. This is the kind of transparency and real-time business that we are seeking to bring.